Moving to some WDA tennis that's also able to move indoors. Minot North hosting Dickinson, looking for their first win at the varsity level. Let's go to the highlights from the Cameron Indoor Tennis Center. First matchup from court one, it's Zoe Barr from Minot North battling against Emma Stillings out of Dickinson. And it's Barr going forehand to win this rally for the Sentinels. Moving over to court three, Leah Rojas from Minot North takes on Grace Dizel and is Rojas a nice back shot that isn't returned the other way and over at court four Olivia Cobb the Sentinels takes on Ryan Jensen from the Midgets and it's Jensen chasing it down with some finesse at the net to win the rally and the Midget and the Midgets getting the win in this one nine nothing the final in the capital city legacy locking horns with century on the courts top singles action first game point for Sabres Aliyah McPherson secures it with the forehand winner cross court. McPherson now leading two games to zero. After trading backhand returns, it's the legacy senior return getting the point, making it a 3-0 lead in the opening set. Let's go ahead and go to the scoreboard. Legacy with a 5-2 win.